Well, good morning. This is Ryan, and I've been thinking about some of the challenges that I faced when it came to my church communications and how it was that we got our message heard in the midst of a noisy world. And one of the things that I found was a huge benefit, a huge blessing once I figured it out, was that if I could schedule things in advance, then I was in good shape in terms of knowing exactly when something was gonna be delivered. So what I found really fast was if I could set a delivery schedule where I knew certain days I did certain kind of posts, certain kind of promotions, then it let me sit down at one fail swoop and plan a bunch of stuff out and uh, really have it scheduled. And so I came up with a schedule plan and I know Facebook Live is great sometimes about flipping the video, but here's what I got. I think you can see this correctly, okay? Um, hey, Casey, good to see you, man. Uh, so here's, here is a way to plan your promotion schedule, and it lets you plan ahead and then just have everything scheduled to go. So if you're looking for traction in your promotions, you want to get stuff in front of people enough times so that you cut through the noise of life, but it also allows you to have the freedom to plan ahead, then um, you are gonna like this, all right? And it's easy to follow because it's repeatable, okay? So on, oops, on Monday, okay, every Monday, send out a text message, all right? Um, on Tuesday, you're gonna do a social media post. Wednesday, you're gonna do email, okay? Thursday, you're gonna do social media again, all right? Friday, you're gonna do a text message. Saturday, you're gonna do social again. Sunday, you're gonna do an announcement because you've got people in your building, you got them live in front of you, you can do uh, something in your bulletin, you could provide handouts, invites, things that uh, congregation members could use uh, to talk to friends when they're in front of them. But the whole idea here is that this thing is repeatable. So if I look at this schedule and I know, okay, on Monday and on Friday I need a text message, so I need to write two text messages for the week. On Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, I'm going to do social, so I need to have three social posts ready to go for the week. Wednesday, I'm going to do an email, so I need to have one email ready to go for the week. So I can sit down like Friday the week before, Thursday the week before, and plan all this stuff out and know that come the day I need it, it's done and ready to go. And what this does for you is it builds consistency in how you deliver stuff. Hey, Noel, how's it going? Uh, helps you have consistency in how you're delivering stuff in terms of promoting stuff to people. So they hear it more often, but here's the real thing, is that for people to attend your event, they need to hear about something three to seven times before they're gonna make a decision about whether or not they're going to even attend. So when you do this one week, you're set, and then come back the next week, and I start the whole thing over again. So the cool thing is you just repeat it over and over, and you can change the event, it doesn't just have to be Christmas, change your event, just know each week this is the pattern I'm gonna follow. And then the people who are following you, who are listening to your promotions, who are listening to the communications you're putting out, will start to realize, hey, on Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, I can expect, I'm gonna see a post from you. On Wednesday, I'm probably gonna get an email telling me about what's going on in the life of your church. So it's just a cool way for you to plan ahead, for you to have consistency, and people to begin to see you show up on a regular, basis. So that's what I got for you, a seven-day communication plan that your church can use, uh, whether you're thinking about Christmas because it's just a few weeks ahead, or whether you're thinking even about January and starting to plan. Start thinking about this. Two texts a week, three socials a week, one email a week, and on Sunday when you got them in the building, do some sort of announcement, a video, something that helps tie it all together. Each day you're driving people forward towards when you get to actually see them in person. So that is a seven day church communication schedule for you. And oh, one other thing. Yeah. So 
if you are thinking about your church promotions, you're thinking about uh, where you're headed, especially in the new year, um, I work with churches to help them develop communication strategies, websites, and visual communications that attract visitors and increase attendance. And I would love to work with your church. So if you are thinking about Christmas, you're thinking about the new year, you've got a website project, you are working towards promoting something big in your church, I would love to help you out. So Ryan Hulk, radideas.com. Uh, send me a message. There is a form there you can fill out, contact form. Send me a message and let me know how I can help your church. I would love to do it. Ryan Hulk, radideas.com. Thanks. See you next time.